This week's festival, we were just trying to look at the digital space and what it means and represents in today's society. The role of technology and design and what potential it can have for the African continent or the African market. What are we seeing on social media? How do we create meaning on social media? How do we take something that's wasteful and something that we, we don't really think about and make it into something new? We also find that there's joy in being in social media, so that's the thing. I felt like I want to do something else also and like come here and meet the people here and see how like the cultural sector or the cultural field is going here in Nairobi. Digital technologies allow us to explore things in virtual reality before we actually make them. I'm interested in how to get this fixed media music into a performative space. I really like exploring how we're utilizing technology to express who we are and also just what's happening on the continent in terms of artistic production. In almost every village in Africa I can, I can send emails, receive whatsapps, send messages, send pictures. So I think that for me is a huge revolution. What we're exploring was how we present ourselves on social media platforms, particularly Facebook. I'm using it for my job. I announce all my performances through Facebook makes it cheaper to get people to know of my work. I try to not to use it too much privately because it makes me really nervous. So I guess one of the perils of our online identities is the possibility of someone hijacking who you are because of you know, how much info you're putting out there. I think there's a tendency in digital art that you think as an engineer that you want to solve problems <laughs> somehow and this uh, way of thinking solving problems has a major impact. And we're living more in these online uh, spaces and less you know, interacting in even physical spaces. So I think as this continues, you might just find that all our conversations will always move onto this online platform. Within all this kind of mess of information, what is that one single thread that still runs through all of this stuff that we have to absorb?